Peace and blessings, fam. I'm your brother in the struggle, Ali. And today I just want to give a little clarification about the law of attraction. The respected scholars and scientists on the law of attraction basically teach the three words, thoughts become things. Allah God and the person of Master Far Muhammad teaches us something more nuanced or different from that. We don't believe that thoughts become things. We believe that thoughts are things. The problem book teaches us that thoughts travel 24 billion miles per second. So thoughts don't become things. Thoughts are things. If you want to attract wealth, love, health, or whatever, it happens instantaneously. It happens in a fraction of a section as the scriptures teach in the twinkling of an eye. All you say is kum fire kum. Like if you're uh, in need of money, <laughs> I mean, you can say, okay, specifically to the universe, what is it that you need? You're like, All right, I need some money. All right, well, the universe is like, well, everybody needs money. You know what I mean? You walk down the street, you found a penny. Two weeks later, three days later, you said you needed some money. There you go, right there. Oh, I need some money. Oh, there's a quarter right there. Oh, I need some money. Oh, they gave me too much change. They gave me an extra dollar. There's your money right there. So be specific. Answer the six essential elements within yourself. Who, what, when, where, how, and why. Using what? Your seven mind dimensions. The physical, the emotional, the mental, the spiritual, the soul, the self, and the will. All money is not physical. Some money is good health. Some money is love. Some money is happiness. Some people got a whole bunch of physical money and they miserable, see? So be careful what you wish for. Be careful what you pray for. You pray within and you work without. So if you want some money, be specific, be like, okay, I want $100,000 before the end of this year. And there he came. You see that? The $100,000 before the words left your mouth, your brain seen that $100,000 in your conscious and subconsciousness. Now, all you gotta do is focus on that. But if you're focusing on, oh man, my credit card bill coming, oh, my debts, oh, I ain't got enough money. Now you're attracting debt again. Instead of focusing on the wealth, focusing on your money. You have to believe that you already received in order for you to achieve. Peace and blessings, fam. I'm your brother in the struggle. I'll leave. The struggle continues.